Hey, what's going on guys? It's Brando Linick here and welcome to the video. Uh, I'm going to be talking about really quickly over the next maybe two, possibly three minutes, uh, how to actually get advertising on your blog to make money. Um, my experience with this, my story, the whole reason why you're going to want to actually pay attention to what I'm going to share with you is because uh, I've actually done this. I've done this before and there's and there's two different ways you can do this, all right? Uh, having tried both of them, I'm going to fill you in on what to be aware of, what to look out for. Uh, so you can make an informed decision by the end of this video whether or not uh, one or the other is right for you or whether or not you don't want to try either of them, all right? So the first approach that you could take when it comes to putting advertising on your blog is to go with AdSense, all right? You can put Google AdSense ads there, um, and it does work. It is effective, however, the only thing is you have to be getting tons of traffic to your blog. If your traffic is minuscule, if you're only getting a couple visitors, even a couple hundred visitors or a thousand visitors per day to your blog, you're not going to make that much money. You're not going to be able to create an income. Maybe some pocket change in a month total, all right? We're talking like 31 days here. Uh, you'll have maybe like 30 bucks that you've made, but it won't be an income, all right? You have to get we're talking tens of thousands of visitors to your blog, which means you got to create a lot of content, which means you got to push and promote a lot of stuff, okay? And you want to get specific to things. But uh, that's the first approach. The only downside is it's more of a long-term strategy. It does work. It is effective. Now, the second strategy is something that I was persistent in trying to succeed at, and I did get you know my advertising up and off the ground with my blog when I started it, uh, but it was grueling. <laughs> All right, and what am I talking about here? Um, actually promoting your blog um, to local business owners or to business owners that uh, have businesses that are related to what your blog is about. So if you're blogging about marketing, if you're blogging about uh, lifestyle or weight loss, um, you can actually go on sites like LinkedIn and you can connect with people. And the idea is you want to build rapport with a person, all right? Because if you look at advertising costs nowadays, it's expensive to advertise. But you got to make sure, in turn, you got to have traffic coming to the site, all right? If you don't have traffic coming to your blog when you're going and you're promoting and you're, you're I guess you could say, pitching local business owners, small business owners uh, to put their ads on your site for a fee of, you know, 50 bucks a month, 100 bucks a month, you got to make sure that there's actual traffic there. They're not going to put, you know, $50 investments every single month on your site to have their banner on your site if they're, it's only being seen by a couple people. So again, it's all about getting lots of traffic to your site <laughs> when it comes to, you know, blog advertising. Um, my experience with this, you know, the best additional advice I could give you um, goes back about 12 months ago when I took myself from advertising blogging, all right, to finding a guy who is on the internet blogging, running a website uh, without having to really develop his website. He didn't, any, he didn't do any of that technical stuff. He wasn't creating his own products and services, making a ridiculous amount of money, uh, you know, blogging. And I started to model and copy what he was doing and in a period of two weeks was able to create a full-time income working part-time uh, because he wasn't having to get a ton of traffic to his blog to do this, all right? And he wasn't doing anything technical. And I know you're looking for, you know, how to actually make money with advertising and put advertising on a blog. And before you make that approach, you know, uh, the best thing I can suggest to you is find someone who's online who's not doing that. If you don't want to do those two things, if you don't want to wait long term, not saying that that's bad or right or wrong, um, just saying if you want to do something in a more strategic manner, in a more lucrative fashion, okay, find someone who's already doing that online and lock arms with them. So my friend, that's just my tip. That's my overview. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if in addition, you want to learn a little bit more about how I've been able to blog, create a full-time income, working part-time on the internet uh, without, you know, having to get tens of thousands of visitors to my site, you can check out my site. It's 123marketingtips.com. I'll put a link down in the description below. What you'll see when you go there is a video from myself really breaking down the nuts and bolts of how I've been able to do this and how you can too without doing anything technical because after that you'll see testimonials from people who I've personally worked with who have done this to create full-time and part-time incomes average ordinary people who have never blogged before all right some people who have blogged before but struggled doing this it's pretty cool stuff so you'll be able to see that on the inside but that said my friend it's been a pleasure uh, to have this conversation with you look forward to helping you as best as I can hope that means a lot I know it's a YouTube video but I will see you this year on the beach of the world take care